Okay. Read the producer is asking, do you think the term ex-Muslim needs to be updated, especially with several ex-Muslims aligning themselves with far right wing movements? They're not necessarily rational. Is this a concern? Okay, well, as a non never ex-Muslim, I have to say, no, that's ludicrous. There are other people who are atheists who are also on the far right. I don't agree with them. That doesn't make me any less of an atheist. Since when does a label that you use to describe yourself suddenly become an endorsement of everyone else who uses that label? It doesn't. Simple as that. Yeah, I mean, to, for you, for us to do that, it would mean like we're kind of suggesting that our group, our ex-Muslims have no, we have no, pro all of us are fine, you know, are good. You know, we have no problematic people. Like we don't want to pretend like, because if you make a new group with a new name, obviously there's going to be problematic people in that group as well. We never, we shouldn't claim that we're like all people without, you know, atheists or ex-Muslims. You know, we, we, we're saying ex-Muslims shouldn't be seen as inferior um, to other groups of people. Like they shouldn't be mistreated. Um, and, you know, we, we don't claim that ex-Muslims are all you know great people you know we have racist ex-muslims we have homophobic ex-muslims we have transphobic ex-muslims we have just ex-muslims that are just pure like evil i guess like we have obviously we do because we have many ex-muslims so it's not like there's something within being an ex-muslim that makes you immune to all these other issues um so what's the point what would be the statement that we're making if we're trying to keep making a group that doesn't have any problematic people like are we trying to claim that we are superior that we don't have you know in fact we should like we should highlight them we should be like look we have our fair share of assholes right um we, and we don't claim we don't want to hide it we don't want to whitewash it in fact we should use it as a way to show that unlike other groups of people who want to completely whitewash their problems, we don't want to do that. We want to shine a light on it and own it and be like, yeah, this is, mm, you know, this is the garbage that we have to deal with. Right? Atheist Republic needs your help. We have been the target of many legal attacks by Hindu nationalists ever since our founder, Armin Avabi, blasphemed against Hindu deities. We have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in India. We have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.